Hey everybody, what's my new scrubs? Come on, fans, I'm Files Wilding and tuning in. If you guys want to see me do a get ready with me, please stay tuned. Hey everyone, so I am here with a get ready with me. I haven't done a get ready with me in a while. So meaning a get ready with me is like a get ready with me while I film, in this case is while I film, because I'm about to film like probably a couple of videos. I started late in the day, it is eight o'clock and I work tomorrow. I was off today, but I was doing a lot of editing and stuff like that, so that's why I'm doing this late. Um, as you guys can see, I do have primer on, so I just wanna tell you guys, this is the Wet n Wild Eye Photo Focus Eyeshadow Primer. This is the bomb. Um, I have oily eyelids, so I have to use primer. Yes, it looks crazy, I know. But, um, you know, um, that's just what it is. And it gets tacky real quick, so you have to work with it fast. And that's basically about that. So I do have another one. This is like almost empty. I'm scraping the tube, so I definitely will. But um, um, use my other one um, the next time. But Wet n Wild, that is so bomb. Like, I can't use like Urban Decay. Like, that don't work for me. And plus, this is budget friendly i did a video on this so yeah so my eyebrows was already done you guys if 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 i did my eyebrows on here this video would have been a little bit longer but i would have sp sped it up a little bit anyway but why i do that when i do have a video on this so if you guys want to see an updated video on how i do these fierce snatched eyebrows you know now stay tuned because <laughs> they already done um that's what i wanted to say that's why i was like what? um but anyway um you can definitely um you know oh Okay. Oh, are they sharp or I'm just playing? Oh. Sorry, sorry. Okay. Sorry, sorry. Anyway, um, yeah, and I, I do them pretty quick too. Okay, I hope they, I hope they even. You know what I mean? So you know, eyebrows are not twins; they're sisters. They're not cousins; they sisters. Okay. All right. So I digress. But yeah. So anyway. So we're going to get into the get ready. Get ready means when I be talking, I'm doing something real simple. I was going to do I was going to do a shimmer today, but I was like, we're just going to be basic today because I, it is late. Not late, but it's late for me doing makeup. So I've been using this palette. This is the um, the Warrior 2 by Juvia's. I've been using this for the past like forever. So um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to use my, um, hmm. I think I'm going to use these two colors here. I'm not sure. Yeah, I'm going to use this for the eyebrow bone. But the eyebrow bone, I'm going to put a little bit of highlighter under there. I haven't done that in a minute. But I'll put that over top just a little bit just to, like, brighten it up a little bit. I haven't done that in a minute. Um, so I'll put, like, highlighter or something shimmery on top of that. Since I want to have some type of shimmer, like, be subtle but pop at the same time. So since it's late, um, I will do... A, uh, all around like i'll do next time i'll do a like pop pop my um makeup look but right now uh it is late so we're not gonna do that um so since we got the primer on everything i'm gonna get my trusty brushes these are my brushes from um the rose gold collection from um i'm moving closer um from bh cosmetics all right y'all and um that's basically about that so yeah we close don't these eyebrows are on point y'all so we get ready with me i do i'm gonna speed up some some stuff and um i'm sorry y'all i'm looking at my phone real quick okay so um i'm gonna speed up some stuff but oh this look is nice oh snap well we'll do that next time that's pretty all right, we're just going to do simple because we're going to do a basic, like, red lip type deal. So, um, yeah, so uh, we're going to um, make the um, eyes, um, uh, the wing kind of dramatic and stuff like that. So, so, here we go. So, these are the two brushes here. I always start out with the smaller brush with the less dense. So, this is from the Beige Cosmetics. And we're going to use the brand. We're going to use um, Kafuru here. Right here. Sorry, my palette look a mess. <laughs> So what y'all doing? What y'all doing? So we just gonna blend, okay? Now, this is crucial, okay? When I say blend, I'm not over here playing. This is not for play, play. I say this all the time. But if you wanna look botchy, I mean, that's just the look that you just wanna go for. But um, I don't wanna look botchy. Okay, let's go up closer. I don't wanna look botchy. 
okay bocce is not my friend maybe it's your friend but it's not my friend so this is why i have to blend so when i say blend 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 i be serious with it i'm not for play play this is not for play play at all so when you're blending and i'm not really blending blending that much with this because i'm going to take the fluffier brush and blend so when you are blending you get a fluffier brush okay when you are blending you get a fluffier brush and this is the fluffier brush from bh cosmetics and this will make blending easier with bigger fluffier brushes you're able to um go at a better um not angle but you know blend better because the smaller brush is just basically for the uh, the crease of the eye like the eye socket like right here but you know you can go all over the eye with this and it's good for blending all the colors together when you have a fluffier brush and these are like the main brushes that i like to use when i am blending eyeshadow i do have to buy more brushes so i can alternate so these will not you know wither away because <laughs> i use these to death so yes yeah, so that's basically about that so yeah so i do blend 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 blending is your friend blends your arms fall off and i'm not playing with that <laughs> you know so um you have to do that because if not like i said if you want to look bocce if that's the look that you're going for then please be my guest <laughs> but you know if you want it to look like mine you, you need to do this okay <laughs> but anyway i'm gonna use um what's this yodit okay and i'm gonna put that on the brow bone now i do this because so i can easily blend the colors together okay and so i put this right up under the eye the brow bone here okay now let me just look something here okay all right i put this up under the brow bone right here and then i just put it on like that now i don't swipe it no swiping on there i just like basically pat it then i lift up my eyebrows and i go like this now this is really detailed because i i don't really talk through it like this like this but um yeah so that's just basically about that so yeah so that's just what it is and you just want to make sure that you get as close to the under the eye as possible because you remember you still have like the um the primer and you also have the concealer from when you concealed your eyebrows to make up to make it look cleaner and sharper so you just have to keep that in mind because you just want to make sure that everything runs smoothly and then i do tap it down and bring it down just a little bit just to have the colors blend uh, nicely now this is a bad example of just just going out the house okay now if this is what you want to do okay let me just let me just stop moving around if let me know if this looks nice to you where are we going? Can somebody please tell me where we're going like this? Nowhere. So, I mean, <laughs> bruh. So, when I say blend, you have to blend. This is this is not it. This this is this is this is wrong. Done. No. No, boo. I'm going to need for you to flick that wrist like this. That's how you do it. That's how you do it. Once you wipe up just like this. Look at my look when she'll wipe that then you're gonna go right here because you're um you see what i'm saying so you go right there within here go right there get up here and blend blend till your arms fall off okay when i do the next eye i'm going to speed it up but i just want to talk you guys through this okay it is a get ready with me but i don't want it to be entirely too long i was going to come on here with um this side done already but um i i i know so um i will be speeding it up so um then i'll come back to so you guys can um see what else i'm gonna do and i'm doing something very simple with the glossy red lip you know something very simple um and i was gonna do something you know but i'm like and this is the look i usually do when i go to church um just this part right here like i'm not um all the other other stuff but just with just with this part i usually do this and do like a little um i don't i don't od that much when i go to church it depends though but i, I really don't but yeah so that's basically about that so yeah so i'm gonna dip into here a little bit and then like that okay all right y'all so we're just gonna blend so blending is your friend y'all like i don't be trying to say this to be like you know um okay i don't be saying this to like you know be all 
you know, um, let me bring this mirror right here. I say this because it is very crucial. Blending your foundation, blending everything because you don't want to look botchy. I say this all the time. So when I say it, I don't be trying to be funny. I be for real because that's what you have to do. Any makeup artist should tell you that. And I'm not even a makeup artist. I'm a makeup enthusiast. So they should be able to tell you that. Anybody that's into makeup should be able to tell you that. You see what I'm saying? Because, you know, I mean, I, I, I can't. You know, so um, the other eye, I'm just going to. So don't worry about this like area right here. Um, I definitely will be, um, you know, that will be taken care of when it's time for the foundation. And you got to know how to blend that too, like going into the bridge of the nose too. So you have to know how to do that too. And I'm just going to bring this down a little bit just so I can fade it out a little bit so it won't be too harsh. I shouldn't have put um, nothing really over there, but I was just trying to get rid of the. Um, the eyeshadow primer part but yeah so um you definitely have to blend blending is your friend so please keep that in mind y'all okay see see how see how well that's blending see how well that's looking you see that oh <gasps> oh where is the white space all the white spaces from the primer is gone y'all you have to do this you have to if you're too tired to do this then i, I you just don't you don't need eyeshadow eyeshadow <laughs> <laughs> or just you know what I'm saying just put a line of eyeshadow because you see what I'm saying so but if you like the blotchy look I mean that's what you do that's what you do boo okay all right and just be careful with the eyebrow up here because you know it take it took you like a good 20 minutes to do well it'll take me a good 20 minutes to do but today it took me like about 10 15 but usually sometimes it take me um, too much depending upon the day I'm having but today seemed pretty good because I was just trying to hurry up and plus you know it's eight o'clock so well, 8.33, so anyway, I should be done by like 9, 9.30. <laughs> but yeah, that speaks about that. All right, so I'm going to do the other eye fast forward, and you guys will see the transformation, and I will be back.
do that off camera because <laughs> y'all know that um eyeliner takes a, a minute so yeah so we got that already all right so now we're going to move on to my face is already moisturized so we're going to move on to the primer this is my smashbox primer it's a little crazy but um this is the photo finish and this is what you should use um you don't have to be that close on my face but this is what you should use when you are um you know before you put on your foundation now you should do this because this is where the makeup could adhere to your face and this is where um the makeup can last longer and you can have a flawless finish and this is why i use it and also to have a protection between you know my face have like a barrier between my face and the foundation so the foundation doesn't automatically just go on my face by itself i have put foundation on my face without the primer but i but it was by mistake it was not on accident it was by mistake but the way my techniques are with the makeup um it was able to hold up and i was praying at the same time so um it was able to hold up but it didn't hold up the way i wanted to so i always use a primer now i I used to use black radiance um that was a little tacky and it left my face looking like ashy but um it was pretty good though um but i wanted to go and uh, use um the silicone it's like a silicone fill and um that's not a word but we make it up words today um but i apply this to my face and um i don't apply that much i i just rub it on and um again my face is already moisturized um i use the um a moisturizer i use some gold bond and some um fake ponds <laughs> the generic brand from dollar general um you guys know i'm on a, a budget so um and it works pretty good so and along with the gold bond um it works pretty good because you guys know i really have very very dry skin and this um primer really also helps with my skin um as well so yeah that's that's pretty much it about that so yeah, I just try to get that on there, okay? So that's basically about that. So now we're gonna move on to um, Bam. I've been using this for a while. This is the Maybelline um, New York Master Camo. And this is the concealer. So sometimes I use the orange and um, you guys see I didn't hit the pan really hard. So I have to go and get some more. Um, and I use this for my dark circles because you guys know I have dark circles in my eyes. So I do use this. I still didn't get my ColourPop because I did not order it yet. And I do want to order the foundation. So I will be ordering that soon. I'll probably order that the next paycheck. And every time, I, cause I always forget. So um, I might order it this time. I don't know, we, we shall see. Um, but I really do want to try the foundation. I know it's been out for a long time, but yeah, so that's basically about that. But I'm always late to the party sometimes with the makeup and stuff like that. And I need to be up on my game a little bit better and have to do more makeup videos. You guys want to see more makeup videos, you guys? I know I'll be slacking and doing like the planner video and stuff like that. When I get stuck on one thing, I tend to forget the other things that I do on my channel, which is not bad. I mean, sorry, which is bad. All right, so yeah, so that's basically about that. But yeah, um, yeah, so i am um yeah so that's basically about that so i don't put it as much and i put it around my nose too so it does conceal a little bit um my dark circles has been have been, i said has been have been clearing up a little bit because i've been trying to drink a little bit more water i'm a little still bad with that but that's basically about that all right so sometimes i be i be thinking like do i have to put some more stuff on my face but um i just be like oh i'm just gonna move on to the next i was gonna use nyx but i'm gonna use the uh, maybelline um 24 hour superstay because i'm not even going anywhere um because i should have been put this makeup on earlier because i was supposed to go to aldi and stuff like that but i didn't even go so you know but anyway that's basically about that so let's just talk about, all right so let's just talk about some things about youtube before i get into this um i did a video on this um so um i will have everything that i'm using in this video will be down in the description bar below so please look at the goodies that's down below i call the videos goodies so you know that's something new now so look at the goodies down there <laughs> down in the description bar below okay so we're going to um use our real techniques brush i did wash it today um i try to um wash my brushes as often as i can because you guys know you want to wash your brushes because that can cause breakouts and things of that sort so you do not want that and you want to make sure that everything is you know clean because you are you know um putting this stuff on your face and you can cause you know um some breakouts and stuff like that and my face is sensitive so i don't need that so i try to wash my makeup brushes as much as possible okay so i'm putting on putting this one two three a little bit comes on the back of my hand and then i dot it on my face okay as you guys can see here and i do have a video on this on a review on this on the maybelline 
super 24 hour super stay okay and that's basically about that so i love this um real technique brush i've been using this brush forever um i used to use the sponge um but um i'm gonna be using this um mirror right here so okay um uh, because i was using the um, video as a mirror okay um i've been using this i mean this um brush forever um i like the i like to use a brush because you get a airbrush look and um it's really awesome and you have to blend y'all if y'all do not blend um then um you you, you have to blend I, I don't understand i mean if you do not blend you know blending is your friend you have to blend till your arms fall off if you do not do that then <laughs> your makeup will look like this okay okay uh, don't look don't i look crazy like <laughs> do i i look crazy and, and you don't want to like the max so you want to make sure that you are blending it down a little bit on your neck and things of that sort and when you're picking foundation you want to make sure that you're picking it um to what your skin looks like now i know i'm like an oompa loompa because this is what it what what it does and i think i discussed that in my video but um but i've been using this for a while and um you guys know i'm about this life right here okay and i blend 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 a lot because when you're using a brush you can see the bristles but as you continue to blend and continue to blend 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 you will not see the bristles okay so you just have to continue to blend you can't you can't half half a do this stuff <laughs> like you really can't because if you do then you will like the mags you'll look like like you'll look very crazy very crazy okay but if that's the look you're going for <laughs> but yeah that's basically about that so i'm gonna go off camera and then I will come back and then we'll talk about some YouTube stuff. I know you're probably like, you always talk about YouTube. So, yeah, because YouTube is continuing to change. And I want you guys to know the changes as I'm doing stuff. And it was a change that happened today. And I was like, what? And I'm going to talk to y'all about that in a minute. So, after I do this, I will be back. And we're going to talk about that as we finish putting on the get ready. I meant the makeup. Okay. All right, so now we got our foundation on, and now we're going to go ahead and get um, to conceal it even further. So we're going to use the LA Pro Conceal, and this will conceal even further, and this is in the color Beautiful Bronze. I usually use chestnut sometimes, but I pick up whatever I can pick up, you know, whatever's in my little makeup thingy. That's just basically about that. My camera don't be liking me, so yeah. All right, so about YouTube. So today I had put up a lot, a, a premiere live, right? It came out pretty good. And next thing you know, I'm using a brush to um, blend it out. Next thing you know, um, I, um, it says zero views. And I'm like, you guys know I don't care about views, but it, it said like zero views, like nobody watched it. So I'm like, okay, so I had to read like, you know, YouTube and stuff like that. So YouTube is really changing, but after a while it did pop up. So when I was looking at other, um, my other, um, subscribers, um, you know, videos, theirs did the same thing. Like I was looking at bigger subscribers that, you know, that's way bigger than me, you know, bigger channels. And even there said no views. And I'm like, oh no. And the first like minute they get like 55 views or something like that. Or you know what I'm saying? Like, cause they're a bigger, you know, channel and you know, they have a lot of traffic coming there and they've been on for a long, long time. So I'm like, how they, how they say, um, no views too. So I was like, oh, there must be a glitch or they're doing some maintenance or something like that. Or because there's a lot of changes that's going on. And you guys know the changes, um, for YouTube started, I believe, which is the 25th is today. So a lot of the changes that they're talking about, I guess with the guidelines and stuff like that. So I guess that took effect uh, today. So, um, um, so I guess there's a lot of glitches going on and it's a lot of things that they're trying to, um, figure out at the same time. So it's kind of messing up some things and things of that sort. So, yeah. So, um, that was basically about that because you guys know, I don't care about the views, but they, it said zero views. It was said no views. And I was like, wait, I was like, that don't add up. That don't make sense. But I was getting likes and I was getting comments. And there's also some YouTubers that were saying that they wasn't even getting comments. And they were saying because, um, they had children in the video or something like that. I don't know. So I'm like, wow, what's going on? So I don't know if it's a 
quick glitch or what's going on with youtube but it's a lot that's going on so just you know just take heed be careful and if you have any questions i guess watch other youtubers that have done extensive research and also you know you can youtube um you can um you know email google or wherever or the help section or the forum forum or whatever and you could probably find some answers there or things of that sort and you know and that's i think that's that's what i did but um and i i, I you know i read some of the things and stuff like that and i was like oh, okay so that's basically about that but yeah so i'm done with that all right so we put that on oh i meant to put on my crease i'm not really i'm not going anywhere so you know i'm doing this but this is what i usually do and this is to help with the crease line the uh, sorry the smile lines and I put that there and that's to help with the smile lines. And that's basically about that. And then I'm gonna use the Real Techniques brush to blend everything in. And you have to do this y'all because if you don't, it, it's, just, it's just not, it's not gonna look right. I mean, I, I don't understand why people don't like to blend. I mean, this is what you have to do. I mean, I really, <laughs> you know what I mean? So. Then I use this, oh, I use the honey. Okay, I use the honey highlighter here. I just use a little bit of it. I'll put this on my forehead. I ain't really going nowhere, but yeah. So yeah, this is a fake triangle thing. You know how people be doing the triangle stuff? I'll be doing all that. Oh, I got time for that. Nobody got time for that. <laughs> um, yeah, so, oh yeah, I asked in my planner video, what do y'all think of me doing um a review and stuff on Game of Thrones? I was going to do Love and Locked Up, but I got to watch season one and season two about to be over. So it's like, <laughs> no, sis. <laughs> so what y'all think about me? Because Game of Thrones is coming out. It's coming back, I meant, um, April 14th. So if y'all want me to, um, who's your favorite character on Game of Thrones? I want to be Arya when I grow up. <laughs> but my favorite character is Jon Snow. Oh my goodness, okay. Okay. <laughs> oh, he's he he's he's handsome. He's a cutie. But um but I, I, I like him. I like his character on um Game of Thrones and um and his characters that I don't like on him. It's like you need to go. <laughs> okay. You got to kill them. There's already characters that's gone that I was like, oh you gotta go. Joffrey, you had to go. <laughs> Babu. So yeah, so that's basically about that. But Arya, she a beast. So, so okay boo. like she survived out there i was like okay boo i got you i got you yo i was like i think i would have been i mean dad you see what i'm saying like she survived a lot she had a little needle sore you know whatever the case is the faceless and um got the people back from the red wedding and stuff like that i was like okay are you you know what i mean y'all remember what happened at the red wedding that was crazy but anyway, so yeah, that, that was so sad. The mother, the the brother, and the pregnant wife got killed. It was just like, bruh. <laughs> My dude, like. But anyway. But the Night Walkers or whatever like that, like, we're going to see what's happening. They got one of um, what you call dragons, okay? And it's just like, bruh, I'm sorry, I forgot her name, but. <laughs> That's why I need to refresh. Um, Season 7, I need to refresh. But got her dragon, bruh. Like, okay. If y'all didn't see the come on so one of the dragons is, is blowing ice instead of fire now i'm done i'm done so now she only got two little dragons okay and it's like bruh like why why you had to do that so now they're going after the wall okay y'all know y'all know about the wall so they're going after the wall and it's like bruh and i'm gonna need brand i'm gonna need brand to tell people what he see i'm i'm really i'm really brand hello every time he's i see everything you see everything bruh you're not gonna tell us are you gonna tell us because you're getting on my nerves right now <laughs> like so it's a, it's a lot of stuff going on so with that so yeah but let me know if you guys want me to do game of thrones season eight you know what i mean so anyway so i'm, I'm so souped was uh, y'all made us wait like 15 years but it's okay we here we, we we good now okay we we shed some tears but it's okay it's okay i know i shed tears but it's okay anyway i'm gonna use my um little concoction now um my youtube sis qbc um she hasn't been on in a while but i'm gonna need to come back but anyway but she on facebook so but um i learned a lot of tips from her she's mua and um she um makes the banana powder i use the banana banana and topaz powder um 
Now I know the Ben Nye, the infamous Ben Nye powder. I used this and I mixed it with that. So I did a video on that as well. I mixed it because the banana is light, so I don't want my eyes to be light, but I also have to um, set my eyes. Now I set my eyes because I'm using a concealer brush. I set my eyes because my eyes do crease, okay? If I do not do this step, um, my, my makeup will look bad after an hour so I need to do this so all this stuff all the steps that I'm doing is necessary and I know a lot of people are like well that's too much and that takes a lot and oh, well you don't have to do all this but if you want to do it like I do it this is what you got to do Bill. I'm sorry to let you know but you know what I mean and I don't put a lot on here and I and this is not baking I just set it on here so it can stay on there for a little bit and then if I, if I have to do some other things around my face I'll do it but I don't bake. I used to bake. I used to put a whole lot. If y'all see the video, I used to put a whole lot of powder up under there. So, but now I don't do that because I don't want all of that, you know, powder or caked up under there. So I just put, you know, enough to, you know, to help with the, the, the creasing because this really helps with creasing. I, I get really bad creasing. So if I miss this step, it's, it's, my, it's, it's over. It's over. I also put on the crease right here. I learned this from some people here, some MUAs here on YouTube. Wherever you put the concealer, you have to put the um, the loose. Okay, you have to put the loose powder. So yeah, wherever you put the concealer, you put the loose powder. Okay. So I'm gonna look for my little brush. Okay, so this is the little. This is this is it right here. I put it in here. I mix the topaz and the banana powder. The topaz is darker, so I don't want the banana powder is very light. Some people just solely use the banana powder, but I cannot do that because it it, it will be. I, I think I will. It's it's too light. I can't. So I'm gonna use my Morphe brush um, to dust away the excess powder. So as you guys can see, I did not stay here. It, I did not bake, so I'm, I don't be baking a cake. I mean, there are ladies out there that do bake a cake. I ain't nothing against that, but when I first started with makeup, I did it, but mm -mm, I can't now. Okay, so that's basically about that. So we got the excess out of here. Okay, now we're going to put um, the um, the setting powder. And the setting powder is the Black Radiance um, Bronze Glow. And I'm going to use my Real Techniques Fluffy um, Powder Brush. Um, I do have to clean it. Yes, I do. I was only able to clean like two brushes today, so yeah, so I have to clean it. But always make sure your your brushes are clean. At least try to clean them at least um, once or twice out the week. And I usually use um, I use um, recently like um, the Bior um, the Bior um, facial um, cleanser to do that. And one of my um, my um, YouTube sisters here um, was telling me that, you know, I think she used her her facial bar, her facial, um, you know, um, cleanser to wash her brushes. And I thought that was pretty cool because it's like you're putting this on your face. So what you clean with your face, you know, you should use on your brushes, which makes really absolute sense. So I was like, oh, OK, boo. So I got the liquid version of the Bior charcoal mask and I got that and I use that. Sometimes I use um, baby shampoo. And sometimes I use regular shampoo like VO5. So it depends, you know, because that's basically about that. But yeah, so I'll put the powder under here like this. And then we go Chi. Okay. All right. I said I wanted to put some like gold up there, but it's like I'm not really going anywhere like that. So we're just going to leave it, I guess. So. But that's basically about that. So, yeah. So, um, what else? Um, uh, yeah. So, we're done with that. And, um, hmm. I think that's, oh, yeah. Um, the blush. Okay, we're going to put some blush just to bring the color back because we are looking flat. So, this is the Artesian Color um, Black Radiance um, Warm Berry. So, this is my, the handle's gone, don't judge me. <laughs> um, but, uh, this is um, the BH Cosmetics um, brush, you guys know. And I like to use this blush. I'll put it on the apples of my cheek. And you smile when I put it on. Cheese. Cheese. Guilty. Okay, done with that. Now we're going to get the Master Camel by Maybelline, and we're going to use one of these brushes. This is not. This is the Luxie brush. I got this out of my BoxyCharm um, 
uh, subscription. All right, so now we're gonna use this. And um, is this the one? Cause I got two brushes like this. I guess so. So we're just gonna tap lightly because you can OD. Cause I know I can OD. And there we go. Okay. Cause I'm not really going nowhere. I'm just getting ready to film with y'all. I'm gonna do lock talk because I haven't done lock talk in a minute. Okay. Okay. And all right. I was gonna put eyelashes on, but I don't even know y'all. I don't even think I should put eyelashes. Get the cupid's bow right here. Gonna hit that ball. A lot of people don't like doing this, but I like the glow like Last Dragon. Cause you got that glow. You're feeling them. You got the glow and you got the no. <laughs> oh, you know, sometimes I put too much, so. And <laughs> got that glow. And you got that glow, Last Dragon. Y'all yeah, know Last Dragon. Y'all know I always say Last Dragon. I have to look like Last Dragon. All right, so my lips, I'm just going to put a little, just a little bit. Look, this looks cute, right? I'm not putting on matte, but I just want to put this on. Because it looks cute. Look, this is Hershey Kisses. <laughs> Chapstick, y'all. Look, it's shaped like it. Got foundation on it. Sorry. All right, so that's basically about that. All right, so now we're just gonna use um, Tartilla's um, Tarte Mascara. Got this out of my BoxyCharm as well. I'm trying to see if I should put on um, eyelashes because eyelashes are fun, but I'm only doing a simple look, so I don't think I need them. But eyelashes are fun. But when I when I do my makeup tutorial, I'm coming back with some um, with some eyelashes. And plus it's late and I don't, I don't feel like, you know, continuing to, because I'm almost done with my makeup now. But um, I don't feel like um, doing all that right now. So we're just going to use the tortillas. My sister, she loves this. Um, I might uh, I might buy this for her for her birthday. Her birthday coming up. Uh-oh. I hope she don't watch this video. I hope she don't watch this video. Uh oh. Oh yeah, her birthday coming up in March. So I could get her this along with some money. Oh, dad, I gotta make some more room. I'll be back. Okay. All right. So my camera had to make some room, but yeah. So I'm gonna hit the bottom la bottom lashes. Yeah, so I'm not going to do eyelashes. I'm going to do eyelashes. Um, I'm going somewhere on the second. So I will be wearing eyelashes probably. But because sometimes eyelashes take too long. But they're fun though. I, I love eyelashes. They're really fun. Very fun. Even though they're fake, they're fun. <laughs> fun! Even though they're fake, but they look good, boo. You know, if you don't know how to put them on, you know, get them put on, you know. Go and get them put on. You know, I don't care, other people, you know. So, <laughs> that's that's what it is. So, yeah, but eyelashes are fun, but um, it's, it's kind of, it's not late. It's like, it's like 938, so I'm not even trying to, you know, put on no eyelashes. But we're going to try this NYX Intense Butter Gloss. Um... And um, let's see how this goes. I kind of want to put the gold, but I don't know. I don't feel like blending anymore. I think I'll just leave it. I'll put the gold next time. I was going to put the gold at my, my brow bone, but hmm, I don't know. We shall see. But right now, we're going to put on the lippy. So...
<laughs> okay, okay, boo. All right, so I guess we looking Gucci. <laughs> okay, I guess it's cool. All right, so this is the intense butter gloss. It's, it is intense butter gloss. And um, it says, drench your lips in extreme color with our signature buttery smooth gloss. All right, and this color is cranberry pie. Hmm. Cranberry pie. Okay, y'all. Cranberry pie. How does it look? Cranberry pie. Look like a snack. <laughs> look like a snack. <laughs> so, so. But anyway, so this is what it is. Okay, as you guys can see. Um, you can probably purchase from your local Walgreens or um Ulta or whatever the case is. And that's basically about that. All right. And so I guess that's basically about that. And then we're going to use the Fast and Fabulous 12 Power. 12 hour power makeup setting spray okay i purchased this from walmart and this was about like six dollars okay all right so i'm just gonna spray a little bit because i ain't going away so yeah so i think i'm done with everything um all right so let me just spray this real quick okay you want to put on Okay, so you want to put on this setting spray because this is what sets all your makeup in. But you don't want to put it on your lips because it can make your lips like matte or it can make it, you know, so they don't put on your lips, um, don't spray it on your lips. But um, this definitely sets everything in. Whatever that you did to your face, it sets all of it in and it, and it just closes everything. It's like the last sealant of whatever you put on your face, okay? So what I have done today is basically a... Okay, so basically what I've done today is a basic makeup look. This is basic, basic as F, okay? And so that's basically what I'm going to put. Um, get rid of my basic as F um, makeup. That's basically what it is. And um, I wanted to do this because and number one is late. And um, number two is not late, but it's too late to be doing makeup. But um, this makeup is like very basic. And this is, gives you the classic look, like the classic red look, you know, red lip look, you know. And um, I also like to make my wings ex kind of exaggerated when I don't wear eyelashes because I do love eyelashes. You know, it's very fun, um, you know. So that's basically about that. But yeah, so this is what it's looking like. And um, you guys can definitely do it. This is definitely beginner friendly. So you don't have to worry about, you know, this, that, and the third. Um, but um, even though you don't have that palette, you could definitely get it um you know um you know you could definitely use another palette with a similar colors because there's a lot of emmyways out here that got these other palettes that i you know that are expensive and um i've been like let me see what similar color that oh, oh i got a similar color that you know what i'm saying so so if you have a different palette that's fine but yeah so that's basically about that but yeah so this is the get ready with me to film i'm basically going to film um i don't know what i'm going to film yet but um that's just basically it about that y'all so I hope you guys really enjoyed this. Um, this is the get ready with me. This is the look. Um, and I usually don't wear um, lip gloss, but this this is popping. I haven't used this red lippy. I might use this red lippy on um, on Saturday. Okay, I'm going to that banquet. So maybe this red lippy is going to look bomb. I'm trying to see what makeup look I'm going to do. I'm going to do something with shimmery in it, you know, since I'm going out. I'm gonna do some shimmery. I'm just, I just wanna glow like Last Dragon. I want, I wanna just shine bright like a diamond. <laughs> shine bright <laughs> tonight. You and I. Remember I did that Fenty, um, that Fenty, um, video. <laughs> Oh, yeah, I got to see that. That was funny. I was, like, I was on the phone. Y'all, I'm going to put that down. Scripture probably low. But anyway, <laughs> so y'all can go check it out. It's funny. The video is long, but in the beginning, um, that's what it is. But it, it was funny. I had fun. I'm always doing something crazy. But anyway, I digress. So, yeah. So, that's basically about that. So, let me know, you guys. So, that's how I put on my makeup. You don't have to put it on that way. Um, I suggest that when you are putting on makeup, just make sure that you're not allergic and things of that sort. And you do it the way you want to do it. But if you want your makeup to look nice and, and, you know, you need to blend. That's just, you need to blend, blend, blend. Blending is supposed to be your friend. Don't matter if somebody come up to you and be like, boo, you're not blending. You know, there's a lot of bold people out here. So just to avoid all that. <laughs> Let's not. I mean, not saying anybody, might, but but I'm just saying like that's embarrassing. Like, does somebody come? You know what I'm saying? That's very embarrassing to go out there looking like that. You have people looking at you like, bruh, did you forget the blend? I'm like, what makeup store did you watch? Saying something. But anyway, <laughs> I digress, y'all. But that's basically about that. So yeah, so just make sure that you blend. That is the number one thing for blending. 
Um, so yeah, you have to blend. I, I, I can't stress it enough. I can't. You know, just doing like that is not, this, this is not what we do. So if you are watching me, then you know, you have to blend. Yeah. So I hope um, y'all got this and that's basically about that. So I'm out of here, y'all. Thank you guys for watching. And um, y'all see this growth. Uh, I'm doing a lot of talk in a minute, so I ain't gonna get. And um, yeah, so if you want more videos like this, please thumbs up the video. Um, share the video. Subscribe if you like. And that's just basically about that. And thank you to all of my new subscribers. Thank you so much. I really appreciate you guys a lot. I'm doing a lot of networking and supporting and things of that sort. And maybe in the future, I'm gonna do some collabs. So, um, and I have done some collabs already but you know do some more collabs so um if you guys are interested in collabs um definitely let me know and um yeah that's basically about that you guys so i'm out of here but anyway yeah my lips a little juicy okay boo. all right i'm out of here i mean i have some questions that's just what's on things i'm watching peace bye